point, we do have some like core things that we pull from, like, for example, to make things funny, like big things, small and small things big. So that would be where, you know, your pen breaks. It's the end of the effing world. I don't know if I could curse on here or not. Yeah, you um, can swear. <laughs> it's the end of the fucking world. And uh, <laughs> but you're getting a divorce from your husband and you're like, huh? whatever you know at least my pen didn't break yeah yeah exactly yeah. <laughs> and you'll see that a lot in like obviously comedy sitcoms like seinfeld or whatever mm -hmm. george is like it's too small yeah, he's like, yeah and it's a huge <laughs> deal yeah yeah, yeah. Um, so there's they, there's little um i'm sure you guys have a word for it i'm gonna stumble trying to find it but there's little mechanisms you can use where you're like hey this equals funny almost yeah we call oh, them right. our little comedy tropes yeah um that we can pull from uh we do a lot of like personification um we yeah, yeah like we, if you know for example if we have like the client is like a health food bar we want to personify you know the health food bar and maybe a candy bar and maybe the candy bar is like your bad ex-boyfriend that you keep going back to and he's like hey lady you know, <laughs> how you been and then you're yep. like i have a new man now you know <laughs> well now you've um, created a universe too where you have a whole bunch of commercials you can do in that in that vein yeah yeah exactly. everything that was ever funny before you can now do as different candy bars you can reenact famous movie scenes as the candy bar <laughs> and the health bar you can do that's yeah. good yeah, yeah. I love, I love you I make a couple it. ideas they start multiplying that's awesome yeah, yeah. 